the client, essentially the stock exchange, we were replacing essentially their command center. So if you think about NASA, it's the place where they can see simultaneously all aspects of what's going on in what is a marketplace. And um, so they lease space in their marketplace to various entities that are trading stock and they need to make sure that their, their marketplace, which is essentially a big machine, is working effectively. So we had to, have, there's a correlation between where activity takes place and where it's geographically located. And so they needed to be very aware of any event and where that is geographically located. So by default, that meant that there had to be a strong correlation between the abstract representation that we were going to give them and the actual ge geography of the layout and the structure, more importantly, of the trading floor. Because I'd like to hire you guys to uh, design a virtual New York Stock Exchange. Um, we both kind of had to pinch ourselves and said, Are you, you're serious, right? This is something you really want? He said, absolutely. I said, and why, 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 what's interesting about the work? Because we, we couldn't put two and two together. We didn't understand the corporate kind of business model desire he had and the, and the kind of experimental work we were doing. He then said, you know, we've been working on this project for six years. Um, we haven't gotten anywhere. All we keep getting from the programmers and the engineers we work with are just these uh, flat planes that revolve and show stock numbers. And it's just not working. And we really need something. And this stuff you're showing me is, is fascinating. And, and if you could figure out a way to build this for my clients, I mean, SIAC works for the stock exchange, um, then I think we really have something you know, quite powerful to do together. So we started working on it.